Hello, my lovely Sagis. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Sagittarius, today we'll do your daily read for December 11th and 12th. Let's see here, loves, what we have from the Gilded Reverie Lenormand and advice for this daily. Also, we'll do your reading with the tarot cards and we'll read the energies around you. All right, loves, we have number three. For some of you, you're taking a trip. Yeah, but let's see here what this is about. Somebody might take a trip and come and see you. Number three is the name of the ship. I take you on a vacation or a business trip. You will need a suitcase for where you are going. Distance is what I am known for. I am constantly in motion. Look at the cards next to me for the clues and cues and the changes I bring in your life's journey. For some of you, somebody's coming here to see you or you're going to see them. Be aware that person is not fully honest to you, whatever it is. Okay? I get here the snake. You might feel this person. It's loyal, but actually they are not really loyal, okay? Because it is a two-sided situation here, okay? So be cautious. But let's see here, loves, what the tarot is giving to you. And what's the energy around my Sagittarius? We'll use the Radiant Wise Tarot. Many of you are asking me about this deck. It's a very lovely deck, very good energy around it. But let's see here for the Sag, what's the energy for this daily? Also, happy full moon, loves. Put the uh, put out there your intention to come to you. We have page of pentacles, message, new beginning, probably dealing with an earth sign. I've seen that, you loves for quite a bit of time something comes to you and it's like I do want to make it right but I know it's not enough I'm not a big fan of the pages as you know pages are very small energy very for some of you it's a rejuvenating energy I see a, a new beginning some sort of regeneration new newness for some of you you get a new job or you applying for a new job look behind it for some of you you need to travel towards that job it is a lot of travel involved or it is a move see beyond that because you might feel it's something awesome but it is something you are not really aware Sag yeah King of Cups earth and fire somebody is offering very small here let's see here what this is about we have the devil capricorn taurus energy empress justice libra wow they're out of bed three major arcana loves if you are not moved on from somebody here there is some closure here the other person is very much thinking how to make things right with you, loves. They might deal with a very strong, very heavy situation, very stuck situation. You know it, Sag. You know it. Let's see. Are you waiting for somebody here? Because I feel here it is a weight of some kind. You, you're still holding back for somebody. You still want that person. Many of you is like, no, I moved on. I don't see it. The cards are telling me the otherwise. You're still waiting for somebody here. Okay? You might be in this a third party. Or it is a third party. It's a mother figure out there. This person could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have the Virgo Minor Arcana, is a Libra, could be a fellow Sag, 
I feel here this person is constantly thinking of you. They're constantly thinking how we can make it. But they've been through a lot. And I don't feel they want any surprises, any craziness in their life. They, they are dealing with the karmic in here. For some reason, what I'm feeling here, you, you don't want either to deal with any any person who is not fulfilling you but for some reason you hang in there the hangman is somebody who knows what to do but is not making it it's just sitting out there let's see here why why the hangman here because you came in your own reading Sag let's see here Six of Pentacles. You're very much like I will steal and heal. I will steal and see what's there for me. It's like you don't make any moves, even you want to do so. You don't make it right now moves here. One more card. Hermit. Very much into that energy like what why this happened? Why this person treat me this way? Why this person did that to me? For some of you, it's, it's truly a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. But I feel here, if you Sag, stay, wait, contemplating, feeling stuck, I don't feel the universe will let you for longer. You have a tower moment coming in here. For some of you, it's sooner. For some of you, it's later than now. It's between now and nine weeks from now, okay? If somebody betrayed you in the past, I don't feel you give it a chance. It's just like you are very much thinking why they done to you. And believe it or not, it's not you, Sag. It's because they've been unhappy. It's because they've been dealing with other things. Their hands were full when you got in their life. They might come here... Because I see them walking away from a very bad situation. They might come back and say, I will. I have just very little to give you. Would you take it? They could go through a very bad divorce or something like that. And you said, you, you, do, you do want something stable. With whoever is this person, you want something stable. You want growth. You want expansion. And I feel here, you are very much higher energy than this person. You are way, way uplifted than this person. Because you are all major arcanas. It's, you know you are way powerful. As the clarifies Hermit and the Hangman. It's five major arcana on your side. This person is its way smaller than you are. They do think very closely of you, but they've been through a lot. They don't need any drama in their life. They walk away from drama. But what was between you two is just like that resentment. It's just like they want to be with you. But what was in their life and then you came in their life gets so much a mess up. Okay? Let's see here, why this Nine of Wands is here. They know you are very powerful. They do know that. Let's see. Queen of Cups. As you've seen at the bottom, we used to have the King of Cups. They do love you. They did love you. And they still love you. Death. Scorpio energy. Cancer energy could be a water, could be an earth. Strongly earth, water, Libra, and also we have a fellow fire sign here. But with who they have, they could have a water sign they ended. But that got very toxic. And I feel here this person got through a lot. It's like burned. It's kind of through the hell and back in here. And right now, they, they don't really know what else is for them. 
I see them walking away from a situation, but let's see here where they are heading for. Where are you heading? Lovers, they made the choice to love themselves. They made the choice to go towards who they do love. And they want a new beginning. They want a new beginning here with the sun. Leo and Gemini energy. But what I'm feeling here, from a very low vibration, this person now is working hard to get again the vibration of love. Vibration of new. They are not interested in any gossip, in any arguments, as the five of uh, ones jumped and that jumped in reverse. I will read it as it comes. But let's see here why this Ten of Swords, Ace of Wands. I feel here you are tired of waiting when this happens, how this happens. Magician, you manifesting a new beginning. You you overcoming things here, Leo energy again. You overcoming things here. You manifesting because I'm speaking here with a single Sagittarius. I do not speak with somebody who is in a relationship with anybody. But I feel here you are very very high vibration at this time. And I feel here you are aiming towards new beginnings, towards something awesome. You see how much fire is here. This person, it shows me here, who, who you've been dealing in the past. I know many of you doesn't want to hear and doesn't want to see it. But this person is your twin loves. We have two twin flame cards here for you from this person. Okay, They are walking away from somebody very toxic. They could be with a karmic, but that's over. That's over. They could listen in the past to work from a mother figure, from parents, from friends, brothers, sisters, whatever it is. They're not listening anymore to anybody. That's over. With who they've been, it's over. Okay? Let's see here you, Sag. Let's see here you. Let's see. King of Wands, speak to me. Moon. You don't really know how you even feeling right now. It's just like I'm manifesting something new. But I'm not super, you know, I'm not very much like sure if this will happen. You're not sure what this will happen, how this happened. But you know it is coming. Wow, I cannot believe, Sag, how many major arcana you got today. And underneath we have the Hierophant. You are heading towards something stable. We have Pisces energy, Scorpio energy. We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn and a strong Leo energy here. Gemini and Libra. But you are heading towards stability. Okay? The Scorpio season was a very big impact on you, also, as we have the Moon and the High Priestess. Very strong energy comes here on the full Moon, so be aware of that. And, you know, the full Moon we have now in, um, on the 12th, in where I am right now, in the location where I am, is... The 12th of December at 12.12 12 a.m. So that's a very magical number. Also, 12 resume to 3, which is about movement forward. And I definitely see here, it is a new beginning, as we have the Gemini energy here. So Sag, yes, I feel here you, you got this. And whatever is coming, it is big. I see it, I feel it, and if you manifest it, I feel here also, for many of you, you learn a, a strong lesson. You're very in tune with your energy, as we have the infinite here, both this magician and the strength. And it's a huge shift for you 
in your life as we speak right now. So if comes unknown stuff, which you never thought it is coming with the high priestess and the moon, it's like your intuition is telling, Sag, this is your way. This it is. If your intuition is telling, don't be afraid. Whatever you dream, do not be afraid. Whatever you feel, whatever you experience, it is meant to happen. Just be in tune. Do not overreact of the things. Okay? If this person comes back to you, they, if you feel like, oh my gosh, they will come and again will give me arguments or something like that. No. They want to make peace with you. They want peace in their life. They want to be happy again. And I feel here they want to be happy with you. This is a strong message for you, Sag. And I hope it resonates for some of you. And yeah, thank you for watching and being here on the channel. And we'll see you next time, Sag. Bye for now.